what's up folks this is joel here in the beautiful basement at the chicago music exchange as you can see by the lovely exposed brick and water pipes and whatnot this is the guts of the operation and today i am showcasing for you this absolutely beautiful gretsch master built caddy bow and this one is uh unique because it is all solid carina hand built by stephen stern at the gretsch custom shop in corona california and it's a weird guitar in the first place. Obviously, look at it, pretty wild, right? It has that like 50s Cadillac look to it, and that clearly was sort of the inspiration for the design. Beautiful guitar based off of the Billy Bo Jupiter Thunderbird guitar. It's originally uh, Bo Diddley's design or his like signature guitar Gretsch built for him. And I guess the story is he had lent it to Billy Gibbons of ZZ Top fame. Uh, to use on some recordings, Billy loved it. Um, he didn't want to take it on the, on the road and expose it to the rigors of touring, which I wouldn't either, with somebody else's guitar, it was really nice. And so he worked with Gretsch to build him a model, uh, became the Billy Bow Jupiter Thunderbird. The Caddy Bow is slightly different because it is all solid. It's not chambered like most Gretsches. And it has this cool little contour, so it's comfortable against your body. <laughs> things that we did to make this a little more unique for us, the all Karina body and neck, and the Brazilian rosewood board. Got this really nice, tasteful, not too in your face, tortoise binding, which we have a Brazilian board, all Karina body and neck. So we wanted the binding to not really take away from that, but still give it that, that kind of luxurious fit and finish. We did a tunematic style bridge, which is not very common on most scratches. And then we have throwback SLE 101 pickups. Throwback makes some of the best aftermarket late 50s Gibson style humbuckers that anybody makes. Actually in Michigan and they use old winding machines from the Gibson Kalamazoo plant to make their PAF style humbuckers. So we went with the SLE 101s, which is just a fabulous set. Pretty low output rating, a lot of clarity, a lot of natural harmonics. You can get some really cool musical feedback out of these pickups. fun playing something like this made by Steven Stern because it's out of the norm of what you see come from Gretsch's custom shop. It's a real real muscular experience um, as opposed to the kind of the more interesting vibey Gretschy experience that great Gretsch sound that you hear about right that most Gretsches do. This is not your typical Gretsch and uh, only here at the Chicago Music Exchange. We might build more of these we might not I don't know. I love this thing and uh, should hopefully make somebody really happy. Also, I changed my shirt in between takes because I spilled coffee on myself. It was a white t-shirt. That would look really dumb if I was just sitting here with the brown coffee stains all over myself talking to you fine folks. So that's why I changed. Also, it's branding. So that's how branding works.